They receive a lot of money from NNPC, PCL, and the IOCs. And just across the corner, you will see a houseboat, a few meters from the houseboat, you will see an oil bunkering refinery or tapping directly from oil well earth. It is very pathetic now. What is happening in the Niger Delta in the past eight years was unprecedented in the history of oil production anywhere in the world. They said they do not have enough armament. And people listen to these false narratives. They are lying. They are liars. I repeat, they are liars. Because I am a participant. I am a participant in this war. I fight on the side of the government of the Nigerian state, in Plateau, in Niger, in Anambra, in Imo, in Habia, and in River State, and in Abuja. Today you are traveling to Kaduna on this road. It's not the army that made it possible to travel to, for you to travel to Abuja or travel to Kaduna, vice versa. It is my men employed by the government of the Nigerian state, stationed in Niger. Today you go to Baga, you go to Chiroro, you go to Wase. We have lost so many men, and we do not use, in all this engagement, we don't even have 1% of the armament deployed by the Nigerian military. Thank you.